So we make vegan, gluten-free, and soy-free cookies that you would have no idea are vegan, gluten-free, or soy-free. They taste that good. So the first thing we'll do is we will get all of our ingredients gathered and mix it up in the mixer. Then we'll take it from the mixer, we'll put it into our dough depositor, which dispenses our little cookie pucks. Um, then it goes from the dough depositor into the ovens where they bake. And then they go from the ovens into this big old rack where we roll it out to our freezer area and they cool. Then after they cool, they go over to my dad, um, AKA the slow wrapper. You know, she doesn't really have to worry about the flow wrapper yet because, you know, she has a slow wrapper because that's what I do. I wrap these things slowly. And then they go from him to the sealer. And so the sealer will seal them and then package them in their boxes and then they get put and stored in the freezer. almost exactly my 30th birthday like right afterwards to go from eating like pizza all the time mac and cheese uh, any types of like pies pancakes whatever to immediately like having issues before that he was fine and then all of a sudden he was sick I found out after about two weeks of of him going to the hospital and they did a bunch of different tests on him. They finally decided that he has uh, intolerance to dairy, beef, gluten, any kind of grains except rice. Rough knowing that if you if you basically step outside of your zone and eat something you shouldn't because it tastes good, you're gonna have to pay for it for a while. He was trying to, we were, we were trying to find things he could eat. Um, we'd go to church and we'd have potlucks and we always bring cookies and whenever we brought cookies everybody knew when they saw us that we were going to have cookies and so it's just kind of what we were known for in a way. And then she said, you know, Nate can't have, can't have these. Let's see if we can, you know, make gluten-free cookies. And I'm going, oh, I haven't got the first clue of how to do that. This was the option for him. We knew that we needed to, you know, help a brother out. It took us about a month and a half to find the right kind of flour. It had to have the right texture, had to look like a cookie that came out of mom's oven, and had to taste good. We tried a bunch of different combinations, a, a bunch of different experiments, you know, so to speak, to see what we could find to replace, you know, as an emulsifier, the egg, you know, how to replace the butter. It was, it was difficult at first. And then we made the cookies, like the recipe that we use today, and my mom and I just looked at each other and we're like, we, we got it. Let's start a cookie business. <laughs> really? <laughs> really, let's? She was like, eh, we don't, you know, we don't need to do this like prime time or whatnot. And I was like, but mom, what if we could? Like, what if we did? But only if it tastes good, I'm not. I am not gonna give anybody something that doesn't taste good. That's, I don't do it. They were good, they had to be good. Because I wouldn't let them bake them in our house. So. Growing up every day with your siblings and playing games with them, sports with them, um, they were, you know, essentially my best friends. Like, you, you're just hanging out with them every day. But the thing that's great about our particular family in this, in this setting is we're really good at bouncing back. You, you can't, not think that it's gonna succeed. And like, I've never, never once questioned whether I wanna be here or not. I've always wanted to be here. We always come back on the other side better than we were before. I mean, you know, we, can, we have no idea what the potential really is. I mean, we're just, we're thinking Lewis County. Maybe United States, Europe, the world. Because getting that cookie, I mean, you're getting a part of our family, which means you're basically part of our family. That's how we see our cookie monsters, is that no matter what, we can come together over a delicious cookie and agree that the cookies are awesome.